there, Andy? Yeah. Uh, Danny mentioned, Danny he, needed mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. All right, let's try to get this. Uh, Black alarm. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm Never back. mind. Let's not do that. All right. Not enough time, so we gotta figure out a different way to distract him, I guess. And it's magically brighter. Now with 100% more sun. <laughs> <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Crazy old timers. All right, let's go see what's up. much in the way of protection though. <laughs> What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? Uh there's something there out of the barn. something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee, the longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. Um. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Alright, let's go. Um, we need to find a screwdriver, too. Now that I think of it. Maybe there's one in that toolbox back there. Ooh, a multi-tool. That'll work. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Alright. Let's go break up the old couple. Because why not? We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. Haha. <laughs> you been getting along with Larry? <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This <laughs> world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. Um... We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys... They can hold their own. Before she died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. Your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? <laughs> Means you can't trust them. Any of them. It's kind of harsh. Um, yeah, how's Mark how's doing? Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He can definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I want to see him still like to check on him. You're going to have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to so, ask this. What do y'all keep in the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. 
It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. Think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Distraction. There, that should do it. Fucking thing, ready to find this piece of shit. Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, all. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. <laughs> Distraction worked. Let us go and see what's in the barn. Ain't got dark outside again. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Run, 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 run. Dinner bell. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. All right, let's get this thing off. One. Oh god. This takes forever. Not exactly in a hurry here. What the? Is that a bear trap? Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Um. Yeah, what the hell is this? What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a You told us you had tools so to run the see, farm back here. Nothing to worry about. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Oh, Brenda, you are wow. an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mom? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all. This must be Terry. <laughs> Gauze pads. Okay, I didn't want to close that. Not quite yet. I could use a shave. Some kind of lotion. Okay. 
Anything else in here? No. Alright, let's go upstairs. Let's go check on Mark. Quiet. Quiet. Eek. Alright. Come on. Come on. Alright. Let's check on Mark. Where's Mark? Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Is that blood? Uh, farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. Uh, right. Do they need so much morphine for? Morphine? Candles. Smart. Musty as hell. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. More IV, there's so many Ugh. medical what is supplies. This stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tube, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Oh. Uh, what the hell? Hmm. What the? Oh my... God. Clementine. Run, 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 run. Hurry, 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 hurry. Grab the gun. Uh Clementine! No! Huh? Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He can use um, some goddamn manners. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. The hell? Damn. You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Yeah, yeah um... eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. No, he wouldn't do his... about living. Settle down, honey. It was an Throw arrow to the, the <laughs> shoulder. You not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boss. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Uh, Kenny, get your gun. Kenny, no. Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black. Put your guns down. We're walking. 
fucking you out of here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't wanna die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. <laughs> Lee? Lee? Hey! Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Dang. Open the goddamn door! You can't keep us in here! Open up! I will tear you fuckers Stop apart with my bare hand! We gotta find another way out of here! Yo! Yeah, That's a lovely imagery. Bastards. Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the goddamn Dad, door down! Stop. It was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. <sighs> you okay, Clementine? I tried to stop you. They didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn thumbsucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. God, oh, God. Meat. Uh, don't wanna know what kind. Please settle down. Oh, I'll rip your goddamn heads off. Chills are pretty sturdy. We could climb up. Uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. Uh. Come on. Try yourself. Don't give up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. There's more of us on the way. Let us out now. Could there be a Do hole behind away? these pallets? Not gonna help. Maybe. Nope. No such luck. Dang it. They're uh... not gonna open the door. I got caught you, duck me. Yeah. Those fuckers have my family! I know! We're gonna get out of here and find them! Am I the only rational person here? <laughs> Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? Oh, my God. Dad, come on! Dad! Oh God, he stopped breathing. We can't I think let him he's die. Had a heart attack. Shit. We. Is he dead? He's no, not he dead. can't die. Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead. It has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel. How fast he turned. What are you saying? Yeah, that's why we can't let him die. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes. Stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! Morning later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! And how do you plan on doing that? We don't have anything. He's not dead! Um. We can't kill him if he's we not dead. can't kill him if he's not dead, Kitty. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Yeah, what do you have Remember it? What, what do you have planned? You gotta destroy the brain. How? We have nothing to destroy come it with. Come on, Lee, I'm right about this. I know you've got my back. You always do. We God can't let him die. Me. I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. What? What? <sighs> Wake up. Is he breathing at all? No, no, I don't think so. We okay. can't let, take over. let him die. His pulse. <sighs> Are you stupid? He's gonna what? turn. You're putting all of us at risk, Three. you son of a bitch. Four. You're fucking worthless, Lee. Five. He's coming. No! <laughs> Kenny, I'm sorry. 
What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. Oh my god. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! I'm in front of Clementine! Are you okay? Is it over? Uh, yes, for now. Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? Uh, yeah, like your walkie-talkie. Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Uh... I'm sorry, Lily. I truly am. Larry and me... He might not have got along so great, but I know he would have done anything to protect you. He was a good father. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lily. Oh, uh, Kenny, I know you did what needed to be I done. I want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we've got to have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Dust? It's never going to come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have... No! They, they need Katya, remember? Well, she's the whole reason they brought us here. What about no Duck? No doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. And if they're using... Why didn't they use Clementine as a bargaining chip? <sighs> there ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off. If I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. A coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. Mm. I don't figure they're just able to come off by hand. It's not coming off that way. Alright. Mm. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here, but I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for him, but uh, back at the motor end, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. That's what? right, he had 60 cents. My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. Do what you have to do. All right. Oh, boy. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Excellent. So we have some variable size coins. These screws and get this unit off. All right. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. I'm trying. Oh. I don't see you working very hard, Larry. 
There. Oh my gosh. And of course. That's our way out, me. Um. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. Um. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Oh my gosh. Be careful, Clementine. God, Kenny. Seriously? Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. Hey, we're good. Okay? Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. It is a bear trap. <sighs> that explains a lot. I told you there was something up in this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. Oh man, this is bastards. Disgusting. Mm. Yeah, so it looks like I can only have a one of the three weapons. I'll definitely take the sickle. What the hell you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. Oh, Kenny. Don't die. We don't need another death. I know you don't like me right now, but... If you'd inform me of your plan, I might have supported it. Think they can just walk right out? 